This is OPT strategy using daily time frame. And the reason why I'm doing these videos is to help everyone who is interested to learn Forex trading and to make money, guys. So this is the easiest uh, strategy that I have come to realize once you understand OPT. So if you're watching this video, you will be you will benefit at the end of the day and it will be a very quick video guys. So what I want us to do is that if you want to do OPT on the daily, of course, the analysis are coming from the daily. So we will do our analysis on the daily time frame. So once you come on the daily time frame, you have to check the market structure. What is your market structure? This market structure is an uptrend. So if the market structure is an uptrend, you can see we have an uptrend. The market structure is an, is an uptrend. If you have an uptrend market, what, what this market is meaning is that buyers are in control. Even if the sellers are coming in, this structure is bullish, okay? So even if the market is bullish, you can see sellers coming in. So what we want to see is that we have two patterns. We have a double bottom, double bottom, and we have a double top. We have a double bottom and we have a double bottom. So you need to understand anytime I have a double bottom, I'm double top. Anytime I have a double bottom, I'm supporting, I'm supporting a buy. Anytime I have a double bottom, I'm supporting a buy. Anytime I have a double top, I'm supporting a sell. So the minute you understand the structure of your analysis, like this is the structure is uptrend. Now, automatically, you know that anytime you have a double top on an uptrend, it is not easy to trade it because double tops, they make the market sell. So this market makes it sell. And this selling can be called a retracement. So it can sell little bit and then violates your double top. So anytime you have an uptrend, you are main a main observation won't be a double top, but a double bottom. So yes, there's an uptrend. Yes, there's an uptrend. Yes, there's an uptrend. But you will be observing for a double bottom, okay? That's how you get it. You'll be observing for a double bottom. So even if this market is an uptrend, and even if these market sellers are taking in, you can see the market is selling. My eyes is concentrating on a double bottom. And where the market is, if I look on the left, you can see we have this short double bottom activation. So it is automatically, once you do like that, it's automatically. So you have to keep practicing how to find the double bottom on either an uptrend. So if I, I have an uptrend, I'm interested with a double bottom. If I have a downtrend, I'm interested with a double top. That is the difference, guys. The other, you just avoid it. So I have the double bottom like that. I have my half and I have my neckline. So I have those levels. Uh, before even I trade the strategy for the daily, I will go to the weekly to check if it's OPT. So this is me checking it's OPT. Can you see? Oh my goodness, it is OPT. Once I find out it is OPT, guess what I will do? I will now apply the strategy for daily, which is WBP. So, WBB, we use it on the daily. CRB, we use it on four hour. So here I will be waiting for WBB. WBB means I wait for the first candle, which is green. And let me wait for it. Now, once the green candle appears, I check if it's a bullish engulf. This candle is not bullish engulf. If I notice it's not bullish engulf, I put a box. Once I put a box, I will wait for that box to be broken. Once the box is broken, I can enter my buy and target and get 67 pips. That is the first entry you will get. You are getting how many pips? 67. So once you enter that trade, in automatically the market hit your TP and it breaks the half. Once half is broken, you can still target this market to the next zone. And this now is how many pips? Let's see. This one is 155 pips. So for the stop loss, I keep telling people, the market can still even come to this low. So you will use, you will use, we call it what, ATR for the stop loss. So we are targeting uh, 155 pips. You can see the market first started to sell and immediately the market continued to buy. And you can see the market has 
like that. Once the market has bought, you will be observing for the neckline. And if the neckline has been broken, the market is going this distance. And this distance, we have how many take profits? We have two take profits. We have take profit one to the half of the distance, and we have take profit two to the uh, half of the distance and the full distance. So let's see what the market did. Did it complete the distance? It completed, but you can see there are so many strategies you can do in between as you wait for the market to see TP1, TP3 and TP4. Guys, that's how you trade OPT on the daily time frame. All the best. See you in the next one. Bye-bye. Love you.